How's it going everybody? This is gonna be another update that we're getting today. Some dominoes are starting to fall. So if you're not familiar with what happened today with Duncan V. Becerra, you can click this right there. But essentially what happened is Duncan V. Becerra has been decided to go on bonk. The Ninth Circuit is going to hear Duncan V. Becerra on bonk. Now, because Duncan V. Becerra is going on bonk um, and it's an important California 2A case, we got some updates on Rupp v. Becerra, and I'll just read it for you guys real quick. It is an order specifically on Rupp v. Becerra, and it says that this appeal shall be held in abeyance pending the resolution of en banc proceedings in issuance of the mandate in Duncan v. Becerra. Submission of this case is vacated until further order of the court. Judge Bumate dissents from this order. If you guys watched the Rupp v. Becerra or arguments with me or the video that I did on that, you're familiar with Judge Bumate. He was very pro two ways, what it seemed like. He's also sitting in other cases as well, like the Rody v. Becerra case. And so it's no surprise that he actually decided to dissent in this, but it doesn't matter. As of right now, Rupp v. Becerra is sitting in abeyance. So what does that mean? What does it mean that this is going to be in abeyance? Well, it means that pretty much Rupp v. Becerra is going to be in a holding pattern until we get some sort of decision out of the en banc Ninth Circuit review of Duncan v. Becerra. So again, it's going to be a longer process now, especially for Rupp. Rupp is going to sit in a holding pattern. If you're not familiar with what Rupp is, you can click this video right there and it'll take you to a video where I discussed that case. There were oral arguments that were heard by a three judge panel in Rupp um, when we are waiting for a decision. And it seems like now we're not gonna get a decision until Duncan v. Becerra is resolved by the en banc uh, review in the Ninth Circuit. So that's just a quick update on Rupp v. Becerra and the kind of the fallout that we've had now because of Duncan going en banc. I'll keep you guys updated on anything that else happens and there may be some more dominoes that fall. Um, with some of these other cases, but I thought you guys should know that because a lot of us were anticipating some of these cases um, actually getting some decisions even in Rupp. So if you guys like this video and like support the channel, one of the best ways to do that is to like, comment, subscribe, and make sure you hit that notification bell because that helps the channel out licks, helps to spread the word about the Second Amendment, also spread the word about things like this that are going on in the state of California. So as always, thanks you guys for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And never forget, this nation was built by armed scholars, this nation will be maintained by armed scholars.